This is a review of the Texas Motor Speedway Driving School, and it is an incredible thing. Um, if you've never been and you're into motorsports, I mean, if you're into NASCAR, it's a definitely must uh, go try. If you're in motorsports, it's awesome too. I was uh, taking um, a friend of mine took me, and so I didn't know what to expect, but we got out there and had one heck of a fun time. Um, you get to go out and drive a NASCAR at 150 miles an hour around the Texas Motor Speedway. Incredible uh, deal, you just can't beat it. Um, if you're a fan of any motorsports, this is a, uh, or if you know somebody that likes it, hey, it's a great gift. Um, you go out there and this gentleman, uh, which we'll look at here in just a minute, he gives you a rundown on the track, talks to you about how the cars drive, he's a real cool guy, fun guy and um, you get to look at the cars these are real nascars that you're driving uh, this isn't i thought it was going to be like toned down or like a kind of like go-kart but uh, no you're jumping in a real nascar and you get to drive around texas motor speedway it's a heck of a deal um, once in a lifetime opportunity and the pricing is very cheap uh, considering i mean what you're getting to drive i think it's cheap um but so you go out there uh, they give you a small training course and then you get into the car um, and when you get into the, you put on the suit you get into the car and then you would think that the guy sitting next to you has like a st an extra steering wheel and an extra brake and everything he doesn't he's just sitting there in the passenger seat these guys are extremely brave and so when you're going around the track what will happen is this guy will tell you he'll kind of tap on your leg like you know to go faster he'll tap on your leg um, or if he wants you to ease up, he'll kind of pull up on your leg. And when you're diving into turn one at 150, um, it looks a lot different than it does on the, uh, like if you're watching it on TV on NASCAR, because the speed, you can feel the speed in that wall is right there. And you're diving in, and you're, if you're not used to those speeds, because you're normally driving around 50, 60, 70 miles an hour on the freeway, um, it's, it's really uh, exciting. And, awesome uh, event that you you should definitely go check out if you're into any kind of motorsports especially if you're in a nascar it's a must go uh, do uh, before you die and the prices are i thought like i said was extremely cheap i know they i looked on their website they're actually having deals right now i mean if you just want to do a ride along i think it was a uh, it's on sale for like 99 bucks i think it was like 139 to do a ride along um, and if you actually want to drive the car i think it was normally $2.99 or $3.99 but it's on sale right now for $1.99 and then it just goes up for there you know the, the amount of time that you're on the track um, but yeah if you know somebody who likes NASCAR that would be one heck of a gift um, and for them to be able to do that to be able to actually go out and drive a NASCAR is pretty incredible I mean how often would you get to do that in life and then this is the real cars I, I couldn't imagine how much these cars cost and then um, if you ram one into the wall or something oh, at 150 I mean it's it's a dangerous thing so don't think it's some kind of uh, you know kitty go-kart ride this is the real deal I mean this is dangerous people get killed doing this that's the reason when you go out there they have a hamlet sitting out there on the side so uh, it's it's an awesome deal but uh, and the people who ride with you I just can't I, I don't know if I could do it I couldn't do it especially with somebody you don't know but uh, anyway, if you've been out here and done this, and if you liked it, uh, definitely leave some comments below. I'd love to hear uh, your thoughts on it and what you thought about it. But I thought it was just totally cool from start to finish. I had an excellent time. And at the end of this video, there's going to be uh, it'll show some onboard video from the drive. Um, and then when you're driving in that minivan, they get you all in the minivan and take you around and, and tell you what to do, when to do the clutch, and they tell you all about it. Um, but the minivan is like flying around the track too. That's pretty fun, exhilarating in itself. But um, again, if yeah, if you have any uh, questions or comments, leave them below. I'd love to hear of anybody else who has taken this and what their thoughts on it. All right, take care. Have a good day. Tim, thanks. Go here. Mind you. Dude, it's on the end. Green shirt guy, come on. Green shirt guy. Have fun, dude. Go. Guys, I'm going to tell you all right now, a race car driver would never in the world wear sunglasses in the race car. Once you're in the car, the sun will be in your eyes. The lanes in the 
turns are created by seams in the asphalt. You can see that a lot better than the three of sunglasses. Unless you absolutely have to wear them. We don't recommend it. I'm telling you, you're not allowed to wear them. I'm just telling you, don't recommend it. Breaks in the middle, right? Yeah. You must remember where it's at. So it's staying in the right lane. Watch out. Watch out.
skid marks going into the wall and you are flying. And, uh, it's a lot scarier when you're in the car than it looks on this video.